Hello, and welcome to this video about our thematization demo web page. To get the best out of this web page, you would need to have installed on your browser a MetaMask browser extension and a Coil browser extension. Ideally, it would also be best that you do not use any ad blockers or browsers that block ads with this demo web page. This web page showcases two modules that we have developed to contribute to the web monetization community. The first one is called Web Monetization Video Ads, and the second one is called Web Monetization Revenue Share. You can check out these modules on the following links here. Any feedback you can provide would be much appreciated. Okay, starting with the module called Web Monetization Video Ads. How does it work? Well, it works as follows. If a user does not have a Coil extension or an active Coil subscription, when they play the video on our web page, video ads would show at the start of the video. Alternatively, if a user has a Coil extension and active Coil subscription, when they play the video on our web page, they would not see any video ads at the start of the video. Web monetization payments would then start and would be sent to the content creator. I can show a demo of this as follows. I've set up two web browsers to show this. One without a Coil extension, that's with Firefox, and the other with a Coil extension, and that's with Google Chrome. So without a Coil extension, if I click play on our video, we should see an ad pop up for about 10 seconds and no web monetization payments will start. And my video continues to play. So, if I move on to the case where I have a Coil extension, and that's in my Google Chrome, if I click play on the video, video ads will not show at the start of the video. Web monetization payments will then start and are paid to the content creator and will continue to be paid for the duration of the video. Within this module, we've integrated a few different features to help us with the work. We use the Interactive Media Ads SDK to help us with the video ad examples. We also integrated the Web Monetization Receipt Verifier services such as the one provided by webmonetization.org and the one provided by belinda.so. We set up a web monetization mock-up module to help us with testing. We created a basic example of our module working with WebRTC live streams, but we need to do more work on this for it to be used for production purposes. And we've also worked on examples making our module work with HLS video players and video plugins such as Video.js and Player.js. We believe that this module can help onboard more people into the web monetization ecosystem as it gives people 
incentive to upgrade for a better user experience while still supporting their favorite video content creators.